evolution of Jigsaw. Here we Hello, go. Shout out to Teledanimate for this awesome video. Look animated. I want to play a game. You've made a YouTube channel explaining franchisers and their lead characters. But can you decipher every antagonist in Saw franchise? Act fast, as there's a poison coursing through your veins, and the antidote will only be unlocked once this video is complete. The choice is yours. Looks we like have to finish have the no video choice. or else. So starting from the original film, then let's go through everything you need to know about <laughs> Saw. Guys, and drop a like, subscribe down below, and let me know in the comments below. Have you ever seen any of these jigsaw animated. movies? Animated. And which in one? In the first Saw, a photographer, Adam, and an oncologist, Dr. Lawrence Gordon, are both captured by a stranger oh. in a pig mask with long human hair, and then locked in a bathroom with a seemingly oh. dead body. They're made to play. I have seen this this Saw movie. This, this is the first one that I know of. Stick game designed to teach them a life lesson by. Their captor, Jigsaw. And while Dr. And it's horrible, they have to saw their leg off to get out, Gordon I think. slices himself free, Adam is able to oh. take out Jigsaw. <laughs> uh, just joking. <laughs> it turns out Adam only eliminates another one of Jigsaw's victims, simply following the mastermind's rules. As it turns out, the dead body on the floor was actually the very much alive John Kramer, aka the Jigsaw Killer, a former cancer uh. patient of Dr. Gordon. Game over. In the second film, John Kramer is caught by Detective Matthews. While See, all right, for the for the first one, I don't remember all of that. It's been so long since I've seen that Game movie. Over. In the second film, John Kramer is caught by Detective Matthews while another one of his sadistic games begins, which includes Detective Matthews' own son and Amanda, a former victim of I have not seen any of these movies after the first Jigsaw, who is now secretly working alongside him and was apparently the stranger in the pig costume. John Kramer confesses to Matthews that after his cancer diagnosis, he attempted to end his own life. But when he got a second chance, he gained a new appreciation for living, which motivated him to create his games and offer his victims that same appreciation by, uh, torturing them. Despite this Shh. heartfelt speech, Detective Matthews beats Kramer into a pole uh, 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 until he tells uh, 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 him where his son is. Oh my gosh, look at his face. But the plan backfires. Did he just point that gun at me? Matthews beats Kramer into a pole until he tells him where his son is. But yo! Hold up! Hold up! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Put the gun away! All right? The plan backfires Ooh. as Jigsaw sets him up and Amanda <laughs> locks him away. <clears throat> uh, speeding things along. Uh, where was I? Uh, oh! Right. Uh, so oh, I like what they did with this video. The the narrator, the whole video, acting scared because Jigsaw is gonna kill the creator of this video, aka Talon Animated, if he don't hurry up with explaining this. And if we don't finish, we're gonna <clears throat> die. Uh, speeding things along. Uh, where oh. was I? Uh, right. Uh, Saw 3 finds John Kramer now bedridden and forcing a doctor, Lynn Denlin, to keep him alive with an impromptu brain <sighs> surgery. But his apprentice <sighs> Amanda, driven by envy by how close John and the doctor seem, shoots Lynn, only to be struck by... She's pointing the gun at me again! A bullet fired by the doctor's husband, Jeff, John Kramer's latest test subject. Shot All a neck. malicious plan created by Jigsaw himself, who didn't want a full-on murderer like Amanda to take up his- She is not gonna be doing that with a gunshot in her neck! Mantle. Meanwhile, Maybe Jeff takes seconds. revenge on John with a buzzsaw. In Saw 4, it's revealed that Detective Matthews was kept alive to be part of a new game alongside another detective, Mark Hoffman, both being used as bait for their fellow oh detective, gosh. Rig. But- when Rig tries to save them, he accidentally sets off their traps, seemingly killing oh! them both. But it turns out Hoffman is very much alive, and apparently yet another sucker working alongside Jigsaw. Meanwhile, in a flashback, John Kramer's wife, Jill Tuck, has a miscarriage, which inspires Jigsaw's first ever game to teach the responsible- Okay, like I said, this has been a very long time. So, the guy that acted dead at the beginning, he said he was the Jigsaw killer. All right. So if it was the jigsaw killer, why did he turn into the evil weirdo trying to do these sadistic games? Now, also the jigsaw, like the thing that looks like a doll that is it like possessed? Is it actually a doll? Is it actually living? Am I on the right track or am I way off? Let me know in the comments. Lesson. Back in the present, the film ends with John Kramer's autopsy, revealing he left a final cassette tape for Hoffman. Saw 5, in flashbacks, shows how Hoffman copied Jigsaw's MO to take revenge on his sister's killer, uh, followed by Jigsaw abducting Hoffman and blackmailing him to become his apprentice. In the present, Hoffman's ally, Agent Strom, suspects Hoffman is involved with Jigsaw and pursues him, only to be tricked into an unbeatable trap oh. as Hoffman gets away Tick -tock. oh Tick -tock. this thing that's a, a a ventriloquist doll 
Yeah. Moving on. In Saw 6, Hoffman plants evidence to make it seem like Strom is Jigsaw's accomplice. Concurrently, it's also revealed that Amanda aided the criminal who caused Jill Tuck's miscarriage and was coerced by Hoffman with this information to shoot the, the guys that saved the person then becomes the bad person. The doctor in Saw 3, resulting in Amanda's own death. Hoffman, in the present, is found out by his fellow detectives to be Jigsaw's real apprentice and goes on a kill spree for his freedom. But Jill captures Hoffman, as requested in Jigsaw's now she's gonna be evil, and fits right? him with a reverse bear trap, which Hoffman narrowly escapes. Never mind. <sighs> Give me a second. I just need to catch my breath. <sighs> oh, he's hurrying up. Oh, God. I mean, uh, Saw, the final chapter, follows Hoffman hunting <laughs> down Jill Tuck and now painting her in the lethal reverse bear trap instead. Hoffman then proceeds to escape, but is caught by three pig masked individuals, led by Dr. Gordon, who, after crawling from his trap in the first movie, was nursed back to so... house by Jigsaw and, surprise, surprise, became his accomplice. Do you hear how fast he's explaining all this right now? Dr. Gordon then proceeds to oh, chain Hoffman up and leaves him for dead in the very same bathroom he himself was once trapped in. <sighs> 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 Nearly a decade after John Kramer died, a new batch of victims started cropping up in 2017's Jigsaw, as John is apparently still oh. alive and running a new game. Just joking, this is just a fake- This is teaching me so much about this horrible thing. What Jigsaw, we're on Jigsaw 2017? A flashback, and in fact, Logan Nelson, a pathologist, is the new mastermind. <laughs> After previously mislabeling John Kramer's cancer x-ray, Logan was put into a Jigsaw game, but survived and, yep, you guessed it, was yet another trainee taken under the late John Kramer's wing. Using his Jigsaw knowledge, Logan frames and takes out the corrupt cop who let his wife's killer free. Oh! <sighs> Alrighty, uh, in the latest film, a pig mash copycat is targeting corrupt cops. Detective Zeke Banks and his new rookie partner, William Shank, are on the case. But after Shank goes missing, he's presumed to have fallen victim to the latest copycat, only for it to be revealed this that he- So much information. So much information right now. Faked his own death and is in fact himself the copycat killer. Apparently, when younger, Shank's father was killed by a dirty cop, so he decided to take on Jigsaw's M.O. While Shank invites Zeke to join him in taking down corrupt cops, Zeke instead opts to save his captured father, giving Shank the opportunity to escape. <sighs> <sighs> And Did we make it? Now you know everything you need to know about Jigsaw and his many, many accomplices. Good okay. card, uh, time to grab card. that antidote. Uh, here we go. Um, oops. Uh, you wouldn't happen to have that the antidote. antidote anywhere, Mr. Jigsaw. Hello? S sir? I don't feel so good. Finally. Huh? No, I would be taking that and I'd be drinking it or something. Big shout out to my boy Kellen animated. My face is over his face. Oh God. There, there he is. He's the one doing all this amazing work. Big shout out to him. Go check him out. Oh, he's so good. So, so good. This, these, these videos are amazing. Guys, if you haven't already, please drop a like over there. Drop a like here. Drop over there. Drop here. If you guys haven't already. Well, I will see you guys in the next video.